Check out OneFIFA.com by using the link in the description down below to get yourself fast and reliable FIFA 14 coins. Also, use discount code PENGUIN5 to get yourself 5% off all your purchases. Alright guys, and welcome back to yet again another FIFA 14 Hybrid Squad Builder. And in today's video I'm bringing you a squad in a 3-5-2 formation with a budget of around 35k. But anyway, going straight into the squad and firstly in goal, we've got Sirigu, of course for PSG and also being an Italian nationality, which does prove crucial later on in the video, but he is 84 rated and does have some very good stats. As for our first centre back on the right hand side as it is a uh, free at back formation, we've got Marquinhos again another PSG player, he's got 78 pace and 78 defending and really is a very good player for only around 800 coins. As for our second centre back uh, here we've got Ogbonna, so of course uh, introducing a new league which is the Italian league, and also he has Italian nationality and therefore getting a link with Sirigu and uh, like Marquinhos he has very quick 77 pace and then also 82 defending. Then finally, on the left hand side to round off the defence, we've got again another very overpowered player in Kakeres. Uh, he has got 81 pace and 81 defending, so as you can see, a very quick defence with uh, the slowest player actually being Ogbonna. But anyway, moving up into the midfield, and firstly, on the right hand side, we've got Matuidi. So, of course, they're playing in a defence midfield role, and uh, if you do want to extend your budget, you can, of course, play his team the season card. But nevertheless, uh, his normal 81 rated card is actually very good. 78 pace and 83 defending. As for our other defence midfielder, uh, here we've got Marquisio, so again another Juventus player, and actually the final uh, Italian league player of this squad. And uh, he is an incredible midfielder, uh, probably one of my favourite this year on a uh, FIFA 14. Of course, having this high attacking and high defensive work rates uh, like Matuidi, and uh, originally he is a central midfielder, so you do need to convert him in this squad, but nevertheless an incredible player. Going into our wide men then, and firstly on this right hand side there, we are back in the French League, this time with Monaco, and that's because we have got Dera, of course a, a silver player being 74 rated, and he is the only silver player in this squad, but nevertheless, a really very good player to be fair with 85 pace and 80 dribbling. All the way over on the other side then, in the left midfield role, we have got Marvo. so of course they're uh, introducing a new league again here, which is the Premier League, and uh, this guy is definitely the weakest player in the squad in my opinion, but he is necessary for uh, chemistry purposes. As for our attack midfielder then, and uh, our final midfielder of this squad, we have got Menes, so again another French player playing for PSG. Going into our strikers then, and firstly on the right hand side we have got Falcao, so of course being 90 rated and uh, one of the main players of this squad, really is an incredible player of course having an 89 heading, and uh, really does uh, do a very good job in this squad, especially uh, getting on the end of a couple of crosses from the wide men. Going into our final player then in this squad and round off what is actually a uh, very overpowered, we have got again another overpowered player which is Remy. So of course back in the Barclays Premier League playing for Newcastle and uh, also he has French nationality therefore getting a link with Menez at attack and midfield and uh, Remy has got 91 pace and uh, 75 uh, shooting as well as 82 heading and really is an incredible player in this team. But anyway guys unfortunately that does bring us to the end of this video. If you did enjoy it make sure to drop a like, uh, 80 likes will be greatly appreciated and also make sure you do subscribe to this channel for more FIFA 14 videos.